got way more hype for this matchup than I should be. All right, here we go. We got the green Diddy and the pink donkey. So what do you what do you think of this matchup? Um, I think that uh, <clears throat> the banana is definitely going to come in handy here. Mm -hmm. You got to keep something in between you and Donkey Kong to get th to get past those grabs. I think keep him in the air. Something that mm -hmm. you know Diddy is pretty good at. I think one thing that really trips a lot of like the newer Diddies up, the lower level Diddies, is they're going to have a hard time finding those kills on a big brawler like Coconut Guns oh, DK. Definitely. And he's very good. He's he's always on that winning with Donkey Kong website, which is literally just ding dong for some spy the way. <laughs> uh, he's always on that, so he'll just pull that up and there is ding dong. They're stuck. Because we played some friendlies earlier and he, he was like, oh, well, I didn't know the Charizard ding dong range. I didn't realize it was quite that small. It's just like a moderate size. So. He's, he's learning, and he's very good. He's an honorable mention for this, uh, this brand new power rankings for the Michigan State University. And we're going to, oh no, nice air dodge out from Dragoon. And oh, let's even see what he can do. I don't think the position of it would have connected mm -hmm. with the I think he needed to go for like maybe a nair or like position himself differently on the ground in order to do a couple backers. All right, so we got uh, Diddy Kong in a. Oh, I take that back. <laughs> <laughs> I was gonna say he's in a. He's got strong. He's in a, uh, yeah, I say strong he, stage advantage. He was in a menacing position, and then Kong and then, Gun just putting on all his damage. I think he's dead if he gets grabbed because he's at max range. Yeah, max that's rage. True. The exact percent for max range. Mm -hmm. He might even be out of the earth this point. Yeah, down, 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 very smart. Very good. Game one, Coconut Gun. One thing that I noticed playing against Coconut Gun is he likes to sit in that positioning where you can't really get up attack him, and he's able to cover those rolls pretty darn well if you get off the ledge. Uh, jump is pretty effective against Coconut Gun, and where he chooses to sit, especially if you go straight up, like uh, parallel with the ledge. And then I'm playing Zard, of course, so I have multiple hops. Yeah. Uh, I don't want to call them jumps because they're, they're so They're <laughs> really not. All right. So All right. game number two. What do you think Dragoon needs to switch up here in order to figure this out? Uh, we need stronger use of spacing with that banana. Mm -hmm. We need um, more grabs, I definitely say. Mm -hmm. Got to keep him in the air, get him off stage, mm -hmm. trip him up. You, you, and we see actually, um, <laughs> just as I said, that he gets a grab. But we see Coconut Gun actually playing pretty lightly on the grabs, really mm -hmm. only going for it for the kills and not going for it for percent, which is actually pretty smart, mm -hmm. I'd say. Because if Dragon's looking for those grabs, because Donkey Kong's a grappler, and uh, he has those two tools to get mm -hmm. out of grabs, then... Uh, is that Star Killer? Yeah, that that's is. That's finish it off. I was like, is this going to do it? I was like, it's not quite going to do it, is it? Get oh, so, and get it. I don't know if you caught that, but he just threw up the banana, and it disappeared because it hit a balloon. Oh, balloons. They're, they're interesting things. Uh, we're getting a lot more jab. I feel like Coconut Gun has started using that tool a lot more in his kit here lately. It's a nice, quick option, and it can lead into down tilts and grabs. What I think the biggest adaptation we need here out of Dragoon is, now that he understands that Coconut Gun is going for more attacking options and Ooh. grab options, mm -hmm. he needs to utilize his shield a lot more. Mm -hmm. But that's going to lead into getting grabbed. So that's that's kind of maybe the mind game that Coconut Gun is trying to play with him. But trying, he's to, trying to bait out a shield with all these attacks and then mm -hmm. boom, ding dong. Yep, because that's what Donkey Kong wants is he wants to be able to get those grabs. Uh, that dash tag, very nice at the ledge. And once again, Coconut Gun using this positioning where he can try to like down tilt and possibly catch that two frame. And right oh, there, he's going to slap oh, him away. Yep, and that's going to finish it off. All right, game two to Coconut Gun. That is that going to be the one. set. That game was game one. one? Yeah, game one. I'm pretty sure. No, it was game two. Was it? Already? Yeah. Holy cow, that was so quick. Yeah. I think so. so. Uh, they just didn't update the graphic. <laughs> no way that was game two. That was game two. 